Matt break the news to you of that performance? Um, yeah, it was, it was a little shocking, actually. I didn't realize that that's how it was going to start. Because when I started in season four, I, the stakes were pretty low. And, um, you know, I knew the stakes were going to be higher for season five, but I didn't think we were talking about this. <laughs> um, but, you know, I think Matt finds a way of challenging people. He's, he's good at challenging everyone from, from every department. And, uh, and this, you know, is not something that I do, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> um, so it was really scary. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm from a big family, so I like the attention, but I, uh, we're Catholic, so I have a very low shame threshold. <laughs> it was stressful. Um, and I didn't know any of these guys. So it was, I mean, I knew them a little bit, but, but not, not very well, and so it was intimidating. Well, that was a hell of a way of introducing yourself. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Did you have any idea how viral that would get? None at all. I was just trying to get from one, um, one section of the dance to the other, um, and that was just stressful enough, yeah. How many takes did it take you to get through it? It took a long time, right? It took, like, all day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some of them were with playback, some of them weren't. Those were a little bit more stressful. Well, awkward, I guess, is the word. <laughs> but you certainly blossomed into a fantastic um, scene partner for Don, uh, for John, I should say. So Thanks. What, so um, what happened with you know uh, Megan and uh, and Don's relationship? Why did that marriage go you know off the rails? I know, right? <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I mean, <laughs> I think I I love Megan and Don. If it were up to me, um, they would just still be like hanging out in Hawaii and holding hands. But that's why I'm not a writer. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so where is Megan now? Pardon? Where is Megan now? Oh, well, I can't, I don't want to ruin the end for you, but that's it. Sorry, Sorry, I can't really string a sentence. (laughs) What did you think of the Sharon Tate fan theories? I mean, I think it's so interesting that, that, the, that the fans of the show respond in, in that kind of way, and there's so many other theories that are afloat about the end and everything else. I think it's, I always find that I learn more about the person in front of me when I'm talking, when I'm hearing their opinion of the show than, than I am learning about the actual show. You know, it's, uh, it's one, of, one of the many great strengths of the writing, that everybody brings their own interpretation to it. And, I'm thrilled to be involved in any part of like conspiracy theorism. I think it's exciting. 